Hello and welcome back to episode 2. When am I, am I gonna get uh, the rewind thing? B3 is circle. I don't remember that. What? Square. Pay attention to what the prince overheard as he drew close to where I was being kept. Is this where I should resume? Good. Yeah, like this way more generous with them. Um, with the save points in this game. Which is a very good thing. side Do I need to do? I don't see it. I do not see it. Huh. 
Is this it? No. Nope. This is one thing that, that I don't like about these games, like getting stuck like this. Come on. Is this like a, a metal plate thing? I don't think it is. This is so frustrating. <sighs> oh, here. Many years ago, I journeyed with the Maharaja of India to the island of time, intending to claim its secrets. What we discovered was a barren, ruined place, its halls deserted, and its guardians gone to sand. Strange tales adorned its walls, which spoke of an empress, an empress of time. But of this enigmatic creature, there was no trace. We returned to India with treasure nonetheless, a staff, a dagger, an empty hourglass covered in jewels, and books, such secrets they contained. For even then, I was an older man, and knew that my time would soon be at an end. The books showed me that life eternal was not beyond my reach, but it required the essence of the Empress herself, the power of the sands. But you were gone. They were gone. Or so I thought. I turned my attention towards other pursuits, and left that dream behind. But then, four weeks ago, the dagger stirred. And showed me things. Like seriously? Whispered to me in my sleep. It drew me here towards Babylon. Alas, the Maharaja did not share my vision, would not grant me leave. So I slew him and claimed his kingdom, his army for my own. Nothing would stand between me Who is and talking? my desire. Hey, hey, like, who the hell is talking, first of all? And secondly, I could barely hear a word of that because the volume is like too low for the for the voice. Let me know when you have the time. Let me see if we can fix that. A voice volume. But it is at 100 percent For me, like it's super low. I could barely hear anything. One. Like the longest speech in, in the world. Come on. Do it! Oh my god. This is so yank. Wow. 
Wow. That doesn't look good. <laughs> I'm starting to recognize these games. This is how they are. Masters of frustration. Like, why? Okay, you can't like, stay at the jump when you're jumping. What the hell do I need to do here? You, you can't jump diagonally. Oh. I see. Come on. And then, up here. And this better be a checkpoint. Recklessly, the prince drew his weapon and charged forward, intending to rescue me. It what? was as if he had learned nothing from his past adventures. Or perhaps he'd simply forgotten, made blind and deaf by fear and rage. Should I have gone up there? 
This is how it happened. This is how I died. No! What have we here? Boss fight? The vizier! Ah, you must be the prince of Persia. Come home at last. Too late, I'm afraid. I believe I have something of yours. Oh, no! Kailena! Right am. Dagger. Uh, did I mess up here? Okay, should I have gone up to like uh, to the throne thing first? Father, forgive what I have done. Wherever you are. Oh, maybe that did matter. I don't know. The recall. Recon power. V6. Give what I have done. And you can't skip this. Wherever you are. The palace is falling. Should I continue? I will continue my story from here next time.
What? This is pretty tough, this early in the game. Is this where I should resume the tale next time? Is that a thing? Yeah. And done. of suffering are set in motion by my hand. In taking Kylina from the island of time, I have changed the course of history. Without the sands of time, I never journeyed to Azad, never killed the vizier. Now he lives again, oh, that's driven right. by the same mad desire. I promised no harm would come to her. That, that does make sense. Story-wise. Continue my story from here if you are called away. I am being pushed deep 
deeper into the palace, and further from my enemy. My arm! What's happening? What has the vizier done to me? I don't... Everything had come full circle. The prince had resurrected his greatest enemy. Worse, he had accidentally delivered me into the man's hands, unleashing a nightmare plague across Babylon. As if this was not enough, the prince had nearly been transformed by the sands himself. Though he had avoided death, he had not escaped entirely untouched. Wake up, Prince. Wake up. Wake up! What's happening? The way behind you is gone, so you will have to find another exit from these sewers. Be quick about it. Start moving. Who is talking? Who is there? Should I continue? Good. This is a fine place to start the tale next time. Are slick. Mind your balance. What's this? See anything? Oh. not seem to like the light. What's this?
What? Oh, I see it. The plate. No. Is it here? Yeah. on oh no Become a sand monster. Call it what you want, but you have been given the ability to destroy your enemies. Now use it. What benefit is this? Even as I fight them, I grow weaker. Kill them, then. Let their lives replenish yours. Feels good, does it not? Lead them into the light! Strike while they are blind! What the hell do I need to do? Escape here? No. This seems to be like infinite amount of them.
What is this? It's never gonna end, is it? Wow. I used to kill them. That like that is like more enemy spam than the, in the first game. That was crazy. And I thought I was like doing something wrong there. Grab with the chain. Where what chain? B4 is circle, right? No. Grab with the chain. When you have the time, I will continue. No. But this tale is far from over. Grab and pull. When you have the time, I will continue. Oh. Okay. I assume this is not permanent? It is, if you want it to be. I do not. But you will. What? Like, what the hell is this? I, I can't rewind it. Oh my god. Become a sand monster? Call it what you will, Prince. But you have been given the ability to destroy your enemies. Now use it. What benefit is this? Even as I fight them, I grow weaker. Kill them then. Let their lives replenish yours. That's good. I assume this is not permanent. It is, if you want it to be. I do not. But I'm not a fan of this. Strike while they are blind. Come on here. Did 
Don't do this. Don't do this. Oh, wow. This is... This feels like sketchy. Like, later in the game, this is gonna be, become a problem, I think. I mean, this isn't that hard right now. But I have the feeling that it's gonna become a big deal. Why then is this happening to me? You have been infected by the sands of time, as I am sure you have noticed. Maybe it's the dagger, maybe it's all the time you've spent amongst the sands. Or <laughs> amongst the Empress. Either way, you are resisting it. Mostly. Mostly? You did just transform into something rather unique. So I think the word is quite appropriate. Think of it this way. You have been given a gift. You're stronger, faster. Uglier. Now, now. That explains the transformation. But who are you? Have you not realized? I am your untapped potential, your unrealized dreams. I am part of you. You... You're inside me? What's this? Come on. Say point, please. Wow. This is not good. Oh wow. Say point. We're done with this, please. gone now. Water seems to fight this corruption. Why did you hide this from me? What? And ruin all the fun? Uh, that's not an entrance?
You don't even have to fight, do you? Where are the save points? There's like different routes here. What is this? Is this a secret or is, is that a way a secret? I mean, this seems to be like... Oh. Well, there is something. What is it? Take it! Wait, it's just a safe point. Wow! So frustrating. <laughs> this has to be something special. It's not like a it's not a safe point. They don't give me back the sand. Bonus head. <laughs> right. But there is a save point. 
I haven't been one for ages. Any sand? Yeah. Oh, here. Is this where I should resume the tea? I will continue my story from here next time. Yeah, we're gonna end it here for the second episode. But I have to say that I am re really like enjoying this game compared to um, the boy within that I absolutely despised. Like, this game is like so much better, like, uh, with the camera and the controls are better. And um, I'm, I'm having fun with this, but it is like it, it's still super hard, it's still super super difficult. But it feels um, it feels fair. Like uh, I mean, I'm not like uh, losing because of the garbage camera or like uh, the garbage controls that I did in uh, the other game. So yeah, I'm having fun with this. We're gonna call this episode here, and if you like this, please leave a like and subscribe and comment if you will. And thank you for watching. Bye bye.